Throughout its storied history, TELUS World of Science has opened up a world of new possibilities, experiences and learning for our city and for visitors to Edmonton. We have seen its transformation from Canada's first planetarium into one of the largest and most diversified science centers in the country. I continue to be impressed by the diverse range of educational and hands-on activities that take place here. From public programming to skills development and creative outreach, there is a wealth of information that we can see, smell, touch, taste, and hear a rich sensory experience that only a science center like this one can provide. You only need to look around to see how incredible this space truly is and the asset that it represents for our city. Next June, we'll be opening a next generation planetarium dome theater and it's going to be amazing. And it will continue to be a source of pride for the entire community, continuing a legacy of public science celebration and education that started 60 years ago. Now the Government of Canada has joined with the City of Edmonton, which fully endorsed the Aurora project in all its $40 million glory with a lead investment of $12 million. The Aurora project is born out of need, it's born out of audience demand, we have capacity challenges, we have an aging infrastructure in this building, we have a very rigorous and vivid and well described and understood vision of where this science center needs to go to be sustainable and relevant. It's about science that's relevant to Edmontonians, it's about a northern focus, it's about making sure the original Douglas Cardinal building, the original science center is all that it can be and it's about bringing new spaces into play so that we extend length of stay, we extend our range of influence on the tourism sector, and of course providing inspiring education for all generations.